Hello guys, Dennis here and welcome back to another episode of Nature's Beauty. Uh, today I am going to work a little bit on the, the backyard here. Trying to make it a bit better, a bit bigger, because I want it bigger. <laughs> so we are gonna do that today and uh, I also had a little bit of a Q&A video um, uploaded the, a couple of days ago now, I think. Um, where I um, kind of, uh, it wasn't basically, it, it wasn't to begin with a QA, and a I figured that out while recording. Um, but um, it was my um, 100 sub video, uh, where I also said that uh, if you have any questions, I will do a little bit of a Q&A. And I have gotten one question, I'm not sure if anyone is aware of the video, so little bit of a shout out to that as well. Uh, if you would like to ask me anything uh, in a Q&A, go over there and uh, I will make a video with uh, answering the questions that I, that I can answer, of course. Uh, but we have one question which I want to answer. Um, it's, uh, it's, it's a good question, I think. I think it's a good, a good question. Uh, so I would like to answer it. Uh, let's see, I need to remove the pen, because that is ruining the page for me. Um, I wrote it down, so that it's easy for me to just do something and look down and look back. Uh, so the question is from hashtag best friend. And um, the question is, why... Did you want to start doing YouTube? Um, and uh, let's see. And uh, what would you be doing now if you hadn't started YouTube? And uh, I'm gonna answer that in parts, I think. So, why did you want to do YouTube? Um, I wanted to do YouTube because um, I want to. Uh, have something to do with my day uh, because uh, I have anxiety and um, I'm not able to work because of it. I'm barely able to get out of my house. So I um, uh, decided that I wanted to do YouTube to kind of fill my day. Uh, I'm used to working and um, when I, when I, if I don't get to record, I kind of get depressed. Like, uh, I, it's, it's weird. Uh, um, it's, I'm used to working hard. I had three jobs. And then I got anxiety and I weren't able to work anymore. <laughs> so it, uh, it, uh, it got me a bit sad when, um, when I couldn't work anymore. And I decided that. Uh, doing YouTube, doing gaming, gaming videos, um, is, is work. It's, uh, something to fill my day with when I'm not able to get out. And, um, it's also to kind of get out there. Uh, seeing as it's hard to, hard for me to go outside and be with regular people. Um, it's, it's a real challenge for me. Um, and this way I get to expose myself a little bit. Uh, it, I, I kind of use it as a therapy, to be honest. And, um, I feel like it's working. Um, so yeah, that's, that's, that's why I uh, wanted to do YouTube. It's, um, I want to fill my day. I don't want to sit home and do nothing. Although I am playing video games on YouTube, <laughs> but yeah, I, that that is basically the reason why. Uh, and then to follow up, what would you be doing now if you hadn't if you hadn't started YouTube? Um, I would probably be sitting and doing the exact same thing without recording, minus all the great people that I met. Um, I have met so many great people doing this. 
um, it's um, fantastic. It's um, I I didn't even know I would be able to meet so many great people doing YouTube. Uh, it's uh, it's fantastic. Um, yeah, um, I would probably just be sitting playing in a single player world and binge watching Walsh Knight, B Dubs, um, Jancy, whatnot. Just. I would probably not be doing. I would probably just be doing that. <laughs> um, so. I don't. I don't. Uh, it, it wouldn't be much of a change, minus all the great people that I met. Uh, but I do hope that I will start school soon, though. Um, hopefully I will start my studies to become a teacher. Hopefully. Because uh, that is something that I've been wanting to do for years. Um, never had the attention span to actually sit through school, but I wanted to become a teacher. But I feel like um, uh, it wasn't the attention span. Uh, it was other reasons. Uh, not gonna di dive into those. Um, but yeah, so that is... Uh, the, the, that that's basically uh, why uh, I do YouTube and what I would be doing if I didn't do YouTube. Uh, and then hashtag best friend continues uh, with do you think you will ever do a face reveal or a name reveal? And I'm gonna go ahead and say yes and no. Like, um, I, I'm, I would probably do a face reveal at some point. Uh, I don't necessarily try to hide my face. It's just that I'm not recording with a webcam. I don't have a webcam. I do, but it's on my laptop and my laptop, uh, my laptop is a potato. I'm not gonna, when I first started YouTube, I used my laptop. Because I didn't have a, I didn't have a computer, and I could barely play any mod packs. I could barely uh, record and play at the same time. It, it, it's, it's a potato. When I bought it almost ten years ago, it wasn't. Uh, it could play play games with a relative ease. The the games that came out in like two thousand. Uh, I don't remember the year I bought it, but I think it was 2008 or something? 2000, between 2008 and 2011 sometime, I bought that laptop. And the games which came out then were I were able to play on it. Not on high quality, but like... I were able to play. Uh, I could play Skyrim, I remember, uh, with uh, medium graphics. And our inventory is completely full. We need to we need to fix this. Uh, let's get out of here. Uh, let's uh, sort out our inventory because this is too full. Uh, so yeah, I am. Um, I'm probably at some point gonna do face re face reveal, uh, but a name reveal that will most likely not happen, and uh, that is because. Um, well, I don't want to. I don't want to share my name. Uh, maybe I don't want to risk getting uh sudden things in the mail or something. Um, I know I'm I'm not a, I'm not I'm not a big YouTuber. I, I'm a relatively small YouTuber, but if my name is out there, uh, I could some suddenly start getting things in the mail. Um, and I, I'm not interested in that. I, um, I want to keep my name hidden, but my face, I can, I'm not opposed to do a face reveal at some point. Uh, so yeah, that, that's kind of the, um, that's the, uh, Q&A that I got so far. Uh, let's see. Thank you. And now, I'm hearing sounds outside. I think my landlord is doing doing stuff. It's fine. 
is allowed to do stuff. Uh, let's see. Can I go in here and just throw some food away? Thank you. And now, what I would like to talk about is um, I have a little bit of a thing for you guys. I have... Uh, I have... What do I have? I have um, a little bit of story for this area. Like the real-life story of the area I'm building. Uh, what it's based on. That kind of stuff. And... Uh, I'm not sure where I can fit all of this. So I'm just gonna go ahead and throw them out. Um... A piece of story that I would like to talk about is focused on the farm, um, which this is based on, and uh, the, the it's um it's a little bit of story. It's um it's fine. Let's see, can I store the leather here somewhere? No. Okay. Uh, let's see. There we go. Thank you. And nothing there. Nothing there. Uh. The story, the story. I keep on forgetting, I keep on distracting myself. That's no good. Um, the piece of history that I like to share is from... Um, it, it starts relatively early in the history of the farm. It's back in... We're gonna start all the way back to when it started. It started back in 1100 AD, 1100 uh, AD. That's kind of when the farm started, and um, there was this guy named, let's see here, there was a guy named Ubi, Ubi, who thought that making a farm would be necessary. Back then, uh, it was the Viking Age, basically. And uh, it's... Um, uh, if, if you had 400 people living there in a village, it, was, it wasn't small, it was rather big. And that... It was 450 people living in that village at that time. I'm, I'm making a nether hub. Um, so 450 people were quite a lot back then. And um, they thought that they needed more farms to kind of uh, feed, feed all the people. So the farm started to be cleared out from the forest. It um it was a uh, forest on the farm at that point. So they started to clear it out. They started to um uh chop down the forest, burn it down, etc. whatnot. And um uh rude the the ending of the name, rud, rude, rude. R-U-D, uh, basically means that it was cleared out. As is with all the farms in Norway, if you come across a farm which is rude, rud, or um, rid in the name, it's, uh, it's basically started back then to be cleared to make a, uh, to make a farm. And the farm were stopped being used back in back from 1349 stopped being used then until uh 15 or 16 century then they started to kind of uh, use the farm again clear it cleared it out anew um and uh let's see we need to take a sleep and it's been used ever since and the house we're building were built in 16th or 1700 
uh, 16th or 17th century. Uh, something along those lines. And uh, people have been living in the house ever since. It's um, it's a really old building. It's um, I think it's been historically preserved. Uh, Norwegian Museum were about to move the farm uh, from its current location to the museum uh, because uh, they wanted to preserve it. Uh, they did take the uh, they did take the blacksmith of the farm. Um, the farm used to have a blacksmith, which was taken uh, by the uh, Norwegian Museum. Or maybe not the Norwegian, but the local museum, I'm sorry. The local museum went ahead and took the uh, blacksmith and placed it on their ground um, as my stepdad's dad, my step-grandpa, uh, went in and bought the farm in 1981. Uh, so some of the buildings on the farm are hundreds and hundreds of years old. Uh, they are being preserved. They are... Um, I'm not sure what the word for that in English is, but uh, they are re... Oh, what's what's the word? Re... Redoing? I I'm gonna go with redoing. They are redoing some of the... Um, stuff to kind of make it last even longer because it if not it won't last you know sorry a little bit of a hiccup um they want the farm to live you know live on and be handed down for generations to come so they are <sighs> i don't know that word Help me out here. Um, I'm gonna Google Translate. <laughs> Let's see. Google Chrome on my phone. Google Translate. Hmm. And... Remodel, remodeling. That's the word I was looking for. Um, right now, I think... My mom mentioned yesterday, I were, we were talking a little bit about the history of the farm. Uh, my mom told me uh, that uh, they are remodeling the, the ceiling, the roof. Uh, because it hasn't been done. Uh, the ceiling is leaking a little bit, I think. from he Not like on the inside, but um, on the outside, like the edges... Um, the gutter or what it's called, they are they're leaking. And they're not doing their job, so they 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 need to remodel it. And that I think she said they were doing pretty soon. So uh, by the end of summer, I think uh, the roof I'm building may not be how it is in real life. Um, let me let me see if maybe I can also put up a picture of the building of the house right now. Oh, let's see if I can remember. If I do, uh, that would be great. And um, that that's the house that I'm kind of modeling this house after, and the story of which I just told. Uh, now, the farm itself, I don't think I'm going to build the whole thing. Two reasons for that. Number one. Um, I can't actually fit the whole farm in this area. Like, I can I can um, remodel on the backside here. I can um, remodel. Uh, I can be landscaping and that kind of stuff on the backside like I'm doing right here. But... Um, there are more buildings over that way, and down that way, and road, and all all kind of good stuff. And I'm not gonna do that because the spawner 
and PJ's house is right there. They're going to be in the way of the whole farm being built. So I'm not going to do that. But um, I am going to do as much as I can. And I'm really looking forward to being done with this little thing. Uh, being done with the garden. Uh, because we are going to have a little bit of a... Um, uh, I think we're going to have some crops going here. We're going to have some uh, berry bushes because uh, I, uh, we do ha actually have that. And I think that we are going to go on top there and have a little bit of a uh, field for pineapples and wheat to grow because I need... We need food. Uh, I had the food growing right here. But after I decided that I wanted to kind of build this out a little bit, I had to remove it. And I'm not going to have it there again because um, there, there's going to be a little bit of a path and a, a little bit of a road down here. Maybe not road, but something to lead us down here, at least. Because... Um, yeah, uh, it's, I think it's good. But yeah, uh, so that is kind of question from the Q&A and a little bit of history. And I think we've been going about 20 minutes now, I think. And um, I still haven't talked about a couple of other things that I would kind of like to talk about. For example, uh... The house, I'm going to do some remodeling on it. I'm going to fix a couple of things because um, I, I, I realized while I were working on the um, fire escape. Uh, I'm still not finished with that. I have several projects on the house which I need to do. Oh, it feels just like in real life. There's several projects on the house that needs to be done in real life. <laughs> um, but... um. Uh, yeah, so, uh, what were I talking about? Yeah, the logs, uh, the logs on the house, they are going to be taken away. And I'm going to go ahead and chisel in bits all the things that are supposed to be there instead. And just so I can kind of give it a little bit more detail than I can right now. I think that would be good. Here, we're going to go like so. Okay, starting to look like something. Uh, just so you guys are aware that the logs are not there to stay. They are going away very soon. Uh, I just need to do some more research and look at how things are actually done. Uh, uh, like, uh, it's the... I'm, I'm not going to go into so much depth that I'm going to look for uh, the carry walls or what they're called. Not sure what they're called in English. Uh, but the walls that basically carry the house, I'm, I'm not going to go go and find those. Because, uh, for me, this house is about uh, three and a half hours away on airplane. <laughs> and the, and the um, plane tickets cost about two to four hundred dollars. And it's, uh, it's not cheap to go there, but, um, wow, it's only four hours until this video is supposed to be out. I should probably hurry up. Um, so yeah, we have that. Um, that's one thing that I would like to do. And the other is I am going to be building couple of other things as well on the server um i have one project that i've started and another one which i want to start yep and one of the projects i've started is the nether hub we need a nether hub because we are probably going to be needing it look at that our inventory is full there we go um, so I am going to do that, um, and then there is the question of how to get, no, wait, what? 
not how to get it. But then there's also another project. I'm so sorry. Uh, that is gonna be the um, let's see. It's gonna be the um, words. Am I right? Words. They can be the worst. Uh, the villager trading center. That's it. Because uh, that is something we are gonna be needing. Uh, because um, I we we need to have mending books, for example. So we need to get that going. Uh, I am probably gonna set up some sort of villager breeding kind of deal in between videos if I'm not gonna be doing any work out here. Maybe I can do, do both. I mean, it's uh, it's a few hours until the video is supposed to be out. It, I need to edit it, and uh, it needs to render. It's probably gonna take about four to f four to six hours to render the video. So I think. I think we are done for today. Uh, I have covered all I wanted to cover today. Um, I haven't done as much work as I would like to have done, but this is more of a talky episode, I think. I'm, I'm gonna do those from time to time instead of focusing on what I'm actually wanting to do. Um, that is if there's a topic in the comment section, for example, that I would like to bring up. And um, for example, things like that. Um, or when I'm having Q&A, or if I get additional history for the farm, basically. And I think, I hope that this episode is going to be received well. Um, anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did enjoy it, don't forget to hit that like button. Don't forget to subscribe if you want to see more videos like this. And uh, most importantly, don't forget to have an awesome day. And I will see you guys the next episode. Okay. Bye-bye.